Hello everyone, welcome to my video. This video will be on Apache Open for Biz. It's a software that you can use for your business, for your day-to-day -day operations in your business. So, let me get started. OF Biz is an Apache project. As a matter of fact, the, the name of the application or software itself is Apache OF Biz, or OF Biz for short. So, what is OFBiz? Apache OFBiz is an open source enterprise resource planning system. It provides a suite of enterprise applications that integrate and automate many of the business processes that are needed in today's busy industrial world. Apache OFBiz is a framework that provides a rich set of business processes. All applications are built around a common architecture using common data, logic, and process components. What does OFBiz provide? Apache OFBiz provides a foundation and a starting point for reliable, secure, and scalable enterprise solutions. Use it out of the box, customize it, or use it as a framework to implement your most challenging business needs. With OFBiz, you can get started right away without the huge deployment and maintenance cost of traditional enterprise automated systems. As your business grows, so does OFBiz. You can extend it function you can extend the functionality to meet your more sophisticated needs. Apache OFBiz is licensed under the Apache license version 2.0. The Apache OFBiz project is part of the Apache Software Foundation. OFBiz stands for Open for Business. So let's go over this real quick. What does uh, the Apache license version 2.0 mean for, for anybody? That means that Apache OFBiz, which is basically business software, that means that you can download it for free. Not only that, Apache OFBiz is a what is known as an open source software which means you can download it you can install it on as many systems as you want without having to pay any extra license fees you can modify it as much as you want and you can go ahead and use your modified version in any system that you want without again paying for any extra uh, licensing fees you don't have to pay any fees for any uh, modifications that you make to it. Um, you can either have someone modify it for you or you can do it yourself. Uh, the option is completely up to you. That means you don't have to wait for somebody. You don't have to uh, get permission from the company. You don't have to wait through a, or jump through a whole lot of um, uh, hoops or uh, through a, go through a lot of red tape to get something changed on your uh, OFBiz software. You can just go ahead and do it yourself or as I said pay someone else to do it. So what does OFBiz use in its business uh, software? Well out of the box OFBiz works with um, a web server known as Tomcat. Tomcat is a Java based web server and um, it works it comes with uh, OFBiz, but it can easily, but OFBiz can easily be configured to work with any other web server, any web server that you choose. Uh, some of a few of them is uh, like Nginx, Apache, and Jetty. It can also work with some um, commercial uh, web servers such as uh, Microsoft IIS. Um, it's really up to you. It's not limited to um, to any specific type of web server. You can use whichever web server you want to configure to work with OFBiz. Now let's talk about databases. OFBiz comes out of the box with its own database. Um, the name of that database is Derby. Derby is an Apache uh, created um, Java written and Java based uh, database. Um, it's used 
in um, OFBiz for uh, demonstration purposes, for testing purposes, and stuff like that. But once you want to go uh, full production with uh, OFBiz, you can use any type of database you want, whether it's open source or closed source and commercial. Uh, some of the more popular ones that you can use is um, MySQL or um, PostGre SQL. And if you want to use a commercial database, as we said, you can use uh, Microsoft SQL or Oracle. Uh, as we said, the limits are, there is no limit to which type of database you want to use and implement with uh, OFBiz. OFBiz can be used as an e-commerce tool for creating an online store and a website to display your products and goods. It's portable, meaning that you can use it and install it on multiple systems. You can install it on a Windows server, a Linux server, a Unix server, uh, a web server farm, or a database uh, server farm. Its the possibilities are endless. Um, you can use it uh, to uh, to work with your eBay account, or as we said here, you can make it an e-commerce tool, uh, load it up into a server, and use it for uh, displaying your online store. Yeah, it works real good with that. Now, OFBiz can be used to store your business or company data. That's right, you can use it as a regular database. You can put in your customer information, product information, information, uh, pricing, sales, promotions, receipts. You can even use it as a point of sale. Uh, as, as I keep saying, the possibilities with OFBiz is uh, endless. So, you can use OFBiz for accounting. You can use it for HR information. You can use it for employee data. Uh, you can use it for uh, install for creating um, company structure and contacts. Uh, you can use it for putting in your employees from top executives such as uh, CEOs, CFOs, to uh, tech support information, warehouse information, sales, customer service information, both on personnel and on your customers themselves or the users. Uh, you can use it for all examples and as I said it's open source and it's free two of the best things in uh, technology today so let's talk about some of the applications that OFBiz comes with when you download and install it into your system you can use it as a, an accounting application uh, for accounts receivable accounts payable you can track um, how many uh, of your users owe you, how many of your users and customers um, um, you need to collect money on, or how many have already paid, and um, you can check out their balance. You can use it for uh, collecting inventory on all of your products, uh, keeping track of the products, who has bought what, and who still needs to um, uh, uh, do back orders or whatever you have. You can use it as a customer service um, application. Um, you get customers that are loyal to you and buy from a regular basis or on a regular basis from you. You can go ahead and uh, put their information in the OFBiz uh, database of your choice. Uh, you can use it to create products or if you have products you can go ahead and put them into your uh, OFBiz database and uh, present that online. Which leads us to the next uh, application, e-commerce. You can use uh, OFBiz um, to, to host your online store so that, you, so that your customers can uh, purchase your products online. It's an excellent uh, uh, piece of product and software for that. You can use it for content management, manufacturing uh, information, marketing information, order entry, or point of sales. If you need to keep track of your products, uh, how much of it you sell, how much of it needs to be shipped out, 
it's it's uh, no limitations there are other applications that you can use it for you can use it for blogs wikis surveys you can use it as we mentioned earlier for accounting as far as billing accounts payment get gateways and accounting uh, you can use it to keep track of your um, materials uh, material resource planning and manufacturing if you have a warehouse full of products you can use open for biz for tracking those products keeping information on those products uh, keeping information as to how many of those products you have left after you've so sold a certain amount um, you can use it for affiliate programs uh, pay per click uh, campaigns and marketing uh, you can use it for people and security configuration uh, if you want to keep it in-house and not put it online OFBiz is a great piece of software for installing on your computer to the point to where you can go ahead and just put your employee information in there um, if you have certain um, uh, employees who happen to be of the top uh, executive level you may want to give them different permissions on OFBiz and the lower uh, workers or the workers that um, that you may deem um, uh, uh, regular personnel who, who are facing the customers on a daily basis you may want to give them limited access to OFBiz as far as uh, making sales creating sales receipts uh, typing up work orders or typing up orders to uh, to give to your customers the possibilities like we keep like I keep saying they're endless so OFBiz the configuration potential well OFBiz can be configured for as small or as large as you need it I mean if you're a small mom-and-pop uh, operation OFBiz is great for using on your uh, system you can use it, like I said, as a CRM or as a database. If you have um, a number of customers who are loyal and buy from you from a regular basis, it helps to keep track of them. Best way to do that is to install and implement a database and put in your customer information. That way you can have it easily for when you uh, deal with your customers and whatnot. Um, it's great for small business operations or it's good for enterprise level operations you can do all that stuff that I mentioned before you can also use it for HR information you want to put your employees in there you want to track their their levels of uh, payment their, their the type of work that they're doing any promotions that you may be running any promotions that you may be wanting to do to level up your uh, your employees this is a great way of tracking that. Um, it's easy configured, and as we said, you can configure any type of database you want. Um, once this goes into production, whether it's online or offline, the um, the the database that comes out of the box is Derby. Derby is really meant as a demonstration database. is really meant um, to show people what the software can do but once you put it in production you can put in there any other type of uh, database that you want a lot of people put put SQL in there um, there are companies that maybe use Oracle Oracle is good um, MS SQL is good any database can be configured to work with it so let's talk about the open source end of uh, OFBiz a little bit OFBiz is an open source software that provides commercial enterprise level service and functionality. If you need any feature or changes made to OFBiz, you don't have to worry about any license restrictions. Just either do it or have someone do it for you. I mean, it doesn't get no better than that. I mean, some of the bigger companies, if you have uh, a feature on a database or a piece of software that you're um, leasing or paying a support contract for, um, if you want to make a changes to if you want to make changes to that software you normally have to pay an extra license fee to have it implemented then you have to pay another license or another fee to have it installed on each system with OFBiz you don't have to do that all you do is you pay for the work to get your your uh, application modified 
You don't have to pay any extra license fees, any per seat fee as some uh, uh, technology licenses are, con are uh, concerned. You know, once you download it and install it, it's yours. And it, you're free to do whatever you want to, make whatever changes you feel you need to make necessary without any restrictions whatsoever. So, OFBiz is a great basic set of ERP uh, solutions that are designed to help any level of business owners automate as many of their important time-consuming business functions as possible. It is a simple, free, and powerful tool. I really think you should try it out. I mean, it's a great tool to at least start with, and it wouldn't cost you any money, just cost you some time to follow the instructions and download it which I will be making in a future video, a follow-up video, video from this one. Okay, so in conclusion, let me just say, um, OFBiz is an excellent product and application. As we said before, um, it can easily be imp implemented in, in different uh, um, operating systems. You can install and use it in Windows, Linux, Unix, um, Apple machines, what have you. You can configure it to your. Uh, you can configure the database, and install your own database, or you can use the default one. But like I said, once you go into production, you're going to want to use a a better database. Derby is the uh, default database, but it's just a small demo demonstration database, uh, more or less. Uh, you can build and configure your own uh, web server. Uh, and other than that, using the tool is, is pretty much straightforward. You'll enjoy it. I, I'm pretty sure that you will. Now, for those of you that are interested, don't worry. This information, even though it's in a, a, a PowerPoint presentation, all of the information that I've put in here, I will put in the description of the uh, video itself. Um, I think you'll enjoy using OFBiz. I'll also include links to go to it and uh, learn more information about OFBiz. So thank you very much. Um, I hope you've enjoyed watching this video as much as I have um, creating it. Thank you very much and you have a good day.